Master Mayard. Who's asking? De Sade. I am the legate of the congregation. Well, I'm flattered. What brings you here, Your Excellency? I'm here to talk to you about the mine you have near Vigigador. Are you aware that you have no right to operate it? Nor are you allowed to employ slaves there. But what are you talking about? Surely this is a misunderstanding. Listen, I'm sure there is a way for us to get along. I'm an honest merchant. I've always paid all taxes and the small bonuses needed. Please tell your cousin that I would be happy to send him the gift of his choice. Now, Your Excellency, if you will allow me, I have to get back to my activities. I'm afraid you don't understand, Master. It's not a money problem. That mine is dangerous, and you endanger the congregation on this island by behaving this way with the natives. Come on, don't be so serious, young man. I'm sure it's nothing that a small bonus can't fix. Goodbye, sir. Best wishes to your cousin. Excuse me, Your Excellency, but I must hurry. I have a lot of work to do. Sir de Corsillon. De Sade, my young student, what can I do for you? I verified the contract with Lady Morange. The exploitation of the mine is illegal, as we expected, without even taking into account what he's doing to the natives. I then went to meet Master Mayard. So, what did he have to say in his defense? He turned a deaf ear and tried to bribe me. Oh, some of these merchants are so rich that they forget basic decency. But it's high time we reminded him of who is in charge of the congregation on this island. Here, this is an eviction notice which dispossesses him of all his land for breaching his contract. For his crimes against the natives, he's banished from this island. I will make him aware of this decision, but you should go to the mine immediately. The prisoners must be freed as soon as possible, and the mine closed once more. I'll take care of it. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? Looking forward to seeing you again.
sorry, this is private property. I cannot allow you to enter. I don't need your authorization. I have here an eviction notice signed by the governor's ministers. The former owner, Mr. Maillard, has lost his rights due to a breach of contract. Look, ultimately, we are not the ones who decide. We only obey the boss's orders. In that case, where can I find him to notify him of his loss? You'll find him around here somewhere, Your Excellency. Excellent. Are you looking for trouble? You'd better be on your way. Master Maillard, I'm so glad to find you here. Here is a document from Sir de Corsillon on behalf of my cousin. Considering the fact that you have not respected the terms of your contract of ownership, you are hereby expelled. The methods you used against the islanders has also ensured your banishment from Tear D. Impossible. By what right? Guards, this man threatens me. To my help! I'm pleased to have finished them off. Let's free these poor islanders and find Dunkus. Go without fear. You are free. And know that we are sorry for what happened to you. We must believe that not all of here blow or a loik. He is an on al -Manawi. That's why he understands us. Thank you. We will not forget you.
What brings you here on Omanawi? I was able to close the mine. The man who operated it was arrested and he will be banished. Yes. Those you freed told me. From now on, you are my Karantz, my friend. You knew how to renew my trust in your clan. Just as trees grow back after being cut. Thank you, Dunkus. I'm honored. Will you give us the old man now? If you allow it, I would like to punish him myself. Enough blood has been spilled, and he will only call for more of it, since he loved the forest to the point of killing for it. He will be sentenced to heal it. Every day he will replant what your men will cut down. Every day until the end of his life. Does this punishment seem acceptable to you? If I explain to Sir de Corsillon that the man was sentenced to forced labor, I suppose he will approve. Thank you, Dunkers. It's a wise sentence. Is there anything else? I must leave. Goodbye, Dunkers. Qua Awalums. To my help! And death to the other!
Let's take a look at these chimes. Hmm. Its base is damaged. The wooden tubes can no longer hit each other. We will need to craft a new base. Child's play. I'll help you if you want. These chimes are once again in working order. Seeing where it's been hung, it isn't surprising that these chimes are making no sound. They're far too low and can't catch the wind. Now with the chimes in the proper place, they should sound like they're supposed to sound. The base of this bell is damaged. That's why it no longer makes a sound. I need to build a new one. These chimes are once again in working order. To my help! And death to the others! Watch out! Grenade! These chimes here are simply tangled. I need to untangle them without breaking them. There. Everything is in order. It will chime whenever wind blows upon the branches.
You are here again. I found Padir. He should be along shortly. Whatever made him take so long? He is not a man to be bothered by the beasts. Padir has gone blind. His pride would not let him tell you. And he found himself in the woods, unable to find the herbs. Blind? But... that's horrible. And he left without telling us. That old silly fool. We shall not let him leave the village again. He could have been wounded. Or eaten. That old fool would probably have died from starvation under that tree without your intervention. You were right to speak about his affliction to that woman. I thank you, Renaixen. Your acts are as beautiful as your words. You are welcome here. And I hope you find the Tjarna Hach Kadachtas. Well now, Renaixen. Were you able to... Yes. They are all working. You are very surprising. I now believe your words to be... You need to find her Voglandai. Oi. Good day. My name is Desarde. Would you be the vote? Beer Tirtomod, Renaxe. Yes, I have heard much talk about you from the people in the village. It is rare. We see few Renaxe here. And those who do come are. Do you know where I might find the Mistress of Wisdom? The Tirna Hach Kadaktas? I regret she is not here. Do you know where she might be found? You have earned the trust of the people here by helping Padir and preparing the trail of the hunt. Oh, I suppose that I could tell you where to... What's the matter? You seem troubled. I am. I'm so sorry for you. I do hope you will find it. Then, could you tell me where to find your mistress? The Tirna Hach Kadaktas went into the sacred bosk. And where could I find this bosk? To the west of the village. Into the heart of the woods, there is a passage between the rocks that gives access. Be wary. This is an untamed place. Where are the animals? I must leave. Not welcome here in Nexus. 
I regret troubling your rest. My name is Disarde. I am a legate of the Congregation of Merchants. Mev, daughter of Morrigan, daughter of Cardwin. What is a legate? And what could he want from me? I am an emissary, a representative of my nation. I have come to speak to you about a cure. Of what cure do you speak? You do not show signs of sickness. I am not. But on our continent, many people are dying from a terrible plague. We have named the sickness the Malachor, and none of our doctors have been able to heal anyone taken ill. We have heard talk from some of your people of a cure that is so powerful that it can heal almost anything. You would be. You must share with us the formula. Too many lives are at stake. You come here to my home, and you command me to help you. Arrogance. Renoixe. Please forgive us, I beg your pardon. We have seen so many people die of this affliction. This miraculous cure that we've heard talk of, could you share the formula with us? You are either completely crazed or foul liars. None of this makes sense. But I... Enough! I have lost enough time with your lies and your foolish thoughts. I do not know what you truly want from me. But I will not be used like some puppet.
These roots are so interwoven and taut that it's impossible to get through them. These roots are so interwoven and taut that it's impossible to get through them. I'm happy to see you. Can I do anything for you? Did you have any fellow students? Of course. We were but a small group working with Dr. Asili, but we were encouraged not to get too close to each other. It was more of a competition. Why? What's on your mind? Did you not share your knowledge with the others? Not really. And to be honest, I don't even know if they would have listened to me back then. You would not believe how much competition there is in the universities of al -Sad. I think it's a pity. It seems to me that ideas progress faster when they're shared. That is true, but I did not know it back then. I only discovered it thanks to you. Anything else? How did you feel when we visited the cave? Astonishment, I think. I felt as if I had reached my goal. As if I was finding a long-lost treasure. It was strangely moving, I think. What about you? It was a grace-filled moment indeed. And these rudimentary paintings taught us so much. I would never have thought that mere murals could contain so much knowledge. Because we looked at them in a different way. To us, these paintings were more than just decorations. They were like a window into some knowledge that was completely foreign to us. I used to swear only by writings, but now I realize that there are many other ways to learn. And once more, I owe this realization to you. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. Anything else? I must leave you. There is residue. It looks as if something had been placed here. If she passed through here, there's no doubt about it. But how was she able to get past these roots? This stone steely has something to do with the entry of the grotto. But how? This is obviously island magic. Some sort of ritual. The roots must open if one places the proper offering on the altar stone. I wonder if Ongos, the Voglandite, will know how this works. Were you able to meet the Tierna Hakkadaktas? Yes. But to my grave disappointment, she fled before I could expose my arguments. Yes, many strangers have tried to capture her many times. She must have decided you were one of them. I am once again in need of your assistance. I must take the passage blocked by a door of roots. You had the honor of speaking with my mistress. If she chose to follow the sacred passage, then it is that she had nothing more to say to you. Why would I share with you the understanding of the ritual that protects her? Listen, I was able to meet the Tiernahach thanks to you. 
but I haven't the slightest clue why she fled in the middle of our conversation. I sincerely believe that there was a misunderstanding. You know that I mean her no harm. If I were simply given a chance to explain, I'm certain that she would understand. If the Tirna Hachadaktas has decided to leave, it is not wise to go against... Oh, I am sorry, Renaixi. I promise that I mean her no harm. I just need to... Her help is truly necessary. Thousands of lives... Tell me more. My people have fallen prey to a serious... If we do not quickly find a remedy, but the Tiana Hakadaktas, she will know of a remedy able to heal this sickness that plagues us. You have already spoken with her, and she left. If she chose to run from you, then she judged your intentions less pure than... As you can see, I am on Olmanawi, but I have not received the knowledge of a Denegan. I hope that by entering this sacred place, I will be able to learn more, to gain understanding. You desire to follow the part of the Donegada? It is a part demanding in patience and humility. That does not start here, but ends here. Return when you know the secrets of the caverns of knowing. I'll be back later. If you had shown me your desire to listen, my desire to help you would be strong. Find a seal. Then I will help you. I see. Could you help us remember where you lost the seal you were looking to recover? On the edge of the village, near the river. That is where I dropped it when the wild animals came and chased me away. Thank you. I'm going to see if I can find it. Could you help us remember where you lost... On the edge of the village. That is... Thank you. I must leave. Thank you. 
Ongos. What do you want, Renaxi? I found your seal. It was indeed near the river. Moy heart thanks you. You are a Renaxi like no other. The Tirna Hachadaktas would have been angry if I had lost it. You still wish to follow the Tierna Hach through the sacred passage, do you not? Yes, I do. You must feed the offering ward to enter into the passage and meet her once again. I need to place a seed on the stone steely, don't I? Yes, you must make this offering. I cannot tell you from which plant it is given, but there is a chance there are more in her dwelling. I will let you enter this one time, but treat her dwelling with respect. I ask you. Thank you for your help. Do not be so eager to thank me. The place you enter is ripe with dangers. As do all sacred places, it defends itself with the wild beasts that it fosters. This passage leads to a forest where the ancestors of the Tierna Hakkadaktas makes her home. <laughs> and why should I fear the ancestor? Have stories of the Nadai been shared with you? In your language, you would call them guardians. Yes, I even encountered one. She was magnificent. Then you know of what I speak. I must leave. This looks like a collection of skulls from various animals. I wonder what purpose they serve. All of this is extremely interesting, but alas, it won't help me open the route passage. This plant looks familiar. I saw some not far from here. Unfortunately, it's lost its seeds. I've already come across this flower. It is very rare, even for such an island as Tirfredi. This bark is covered with little symbols. It looks like some sort of writing, though I've been led to believe the natives have no written language. I should speak with Siora when I have the chance. Perhaps she could explain what it is. All of this is extremely interesting, but alas, it won't help me open the route passage. All these crushed plants and these powders. She must have been preparing a potion. It might be the miraculous remedy. Ugh, to be so close and yet to have no idea what to do with all this. With more time, I could study all of these components and perhaps... Oh, I doubt that Ongus will give us a chance to study this. We need to find the Tiernahach. Oh, I don't see any seeds here. The only clue we have is this plant. Let's try to find some other flowers. It might be their seed that opens the passage. flowers perhaps this is these flowers are similar to those we found in the dwelling of the Tierna Hach and they bear seeds a seed to part the roots I'll admit that it is poetic but completely defies all logic we have what we need let's go back to the stone steely
Sade, I'm happy to see you. Can I do anything for you? What do you think of the love that unites those young people? It really seems as if they share something special. It's true. I don't think I've ever stumbled upon two people that were so close to one another. On the continent, where everything is political, it only happens in fairy tales. But here... Is it that you're starting to believe in love? Who told you I did not believe in it? When it is sincere, it is an admirable feeling. But alas, it seldom is. Anything else? I must leave you. 